All right, Home Lot Edition, Wednesday, March 25th. We've got three eight-minute AMRAPs. There's going to be four minutes of work, sorry, of rest between each eight-minute work period. So, 24 total minutes of work. The idea, like always, when we do these in class, is to keep a pace that you can sustain from the first to the second to the third AMRAP. So each one should look identical as far as output goes. Okay, for our first one, we're gonna start with a 200 meter run. And if you haven't done this yet, the best way to do it, one, you could either use Google to drop a pin and actually measure out 100 meters from your house. Two, we're looking for about 40 to 60 seconds of work. So most likely this is gonna be a turnaround for some of you. Run out, time it on your stopwatch, run out about uh, you know, 20 to 25 seconds, see about where you are, Put some uh, sort of marker there, and you're just going to run out to that point and back. It doesn't matter if it's a 200 meters, uh, you know, officially, as long as it's about 40 to se uh, 60 seconds of work. Then eight thrusters. Remember, a thruster is a full squat to extension overhead. Sandbags. You can do, you know, one arm or double arm dumbbell thrusters. You can do a med ball thruster. You can take your backpack that hopefully you made yesterday, and you can use that as a thruster, right? Again, full squat, full extension overhead. You can even do it with a kettlebell. It's going to be kind of goofy, but it'll work. Uh, then eight lemon squeezes from the floor. That's the one where we're coming up, pulling our knees into our chest, squeezing the lemon against our chest. If you've got, maybe you've got a pull-up bar or access to a pull-up bar, or maybe you can use like a child's swing set, you can do hanging knee raises. Probably can't do toes to bar, but a hanging knee raise can work as well. So get creative if you're tired of doing, you know, floor sit-ups. Four minutes of rest. Then, 30 double unders. Scale this by doing 60 single unders. Scale that by doing 30 lateral hops. So once you're done with your double unders or whatever you're doing, 10 supermans. We haven't done these in a long time, but essentially it's where you're laying face down on the floor and we're just squeezing our butt, bringing our front and our back off the floor. I'll link a video uh, so you guys have an idea of what you, what you should be doing here. Then 10 hand release push-ups. If you can't do a hand release push-up, Elevate, right? It's the best way to scale a push-up. Just elevate yourself up, full range of motion, touch your chest to whatever you're elevating uh, onto, and uh, you know, keep it full range of motion. Then, four minutes of rest into our last AMRAP. Another run, if you are fortunate enough to have another piece of cardio equipment, a rower, an elliptical, a tr uh, you know, whatever, use that, a bike, right? Use that 200 meters again. It's about 40 to 60 seconds on whatever you're using. If you don't, run again. Uh, then 12 Romanian deadlifts. Remember, that's our stiff legged deadlift. Ideally, you're going to use whatever you use for your thrusters. Okay? You can get creative. Uh, if you want a heavier weight, then do so. But a uh, 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 Romanian deadlift is our stiff legged deadlift, holding our torso nice and flat so that we are basically just hinging at the hips, putting emphasis on the hamstrings. Then 12 Russian twists. You can use the same weight that you would do it using for your deadlifts. Maybe you need to go a little bit lighter, maybe use a med ball, maybe you use your backpack that you've weighted down. Ideally with your Russian twist, we're getting feet up off the ground, knees tucked, and we're moving from side to side with our butt on the floor, touching the floor with the object. One way to scale that, Put your heels down, right? But we're looking for kind of a constant crunch, moving side to side laterally, working through this last eight minute AMRAP. So 24 minutes of work. We've got interspersed with four minutes of rest. Stay consistent, get creative, keep moving.